The purpose of this video is to give you an overview of how to use Keysight in Westlaw Classic. Keysight helps you determine whether a case, statute, administrative decision, or regulation is good law. You can also use Keysight to retrieve citing references to the document you are Keysighting. These citing references can include cases, administrative materials, secondary sources, briefs, and other court documents. For this video, we will focus on using Keysight for cases. You can access Keysight in Westlaw Classic using three methods. First, on the Law School tab, you can enter the citation of the source you want to Keysight in the Keysight This Citation box. Simply enter your citation, click Go, and the Keysight report will appear. The second way to access Keysight is by clicking Keysight at the top of the page. You can access this link at any time while you are in Westlaw Classic. The Keysight page will provide you with information on Keysight and an explanation of the meaning for each of the symbols used in Keysight. To Keysight a source, in your citation in the box in the upper left side of the page, click Go, and the Keysight report will appear. The third and probably most common way to Keysight a source is by using the Keysight function while viewing the document. When looking at a case or any other document in Westlaw, the Keysight function will be located on the left side of the screen. To view the Keysight report, click on Full History. Full History is divided into three sections. Direct History, which traces your case through the appellate process and includes both prior and subsequent history. Negative Citing References, which lists cases outside of the direct appellate line that may have a negative impact on your case, and Related References, which lists cases that involve the same parties and facts as your case, whether or not the legal issues are the same. In addition to these main categories, the history of a case may also include links to related court documents. If you need a description of what each of the Keysight signals mean, click on Keysight on the left side of the screen. The report for full history can often be more information than you need to determine if a case is still good law. You can limit the full history display by clicking on Limit Keysight History Display at the bottom of the screen. By clicking this, you have the option to show negative treatment only or to exclude court documents and administrative filings. To cancel the limits and return to the full history, click on Cancel Limits at the bottom of the screen. If you click on Direct History Graphical View, you can view the direct history of your case in an easy-to-read graph. Citing References lists cases, administrative materials, secondary sources, briefs, and other court documents that have cited your case. The first section of citing references will always list negative citing cases, followed by a list of other cases, administrative materials, secondary sources, briefs, and other court documents. To move to the next part of citing references, click Next Part at the bottom of the screen. The citing cases, other than those that are negative, are categorized by the depth of treatment they give your case. Many times you will want to limit the number of citing references so that you only have to look through cases and other sources that are relevant to your specific issue, jurisdiction, or other factors. To limit the number of results, click on Limit Keysight Display at the bottom of the screen. Limit Keysight Display allows you to limit the number of results by six categories. The number in parentheses correspond to the number of documents for that filter. The categories are Document Type, Head Notes, Locate, which allows you to refine your search by keywords, Jurisdiction, Date, and Depth of Treatment. Once you have made your selections, click Apply to display the Keysight results with the restrictions you specified. To enter a document, click on the number located beside the document title. 
You will enter that document at the point where it is discussing your case. You can maximize the view by clicking Maximize. To return to the Keysight report, hit back on your web browser. That is it for your overview of how to use Keysight in Westlaw Classic.